Präzises Wiegen und Precise weighing and dosing of different materials and ingredients is becoming increasingly important. With the new Braumat version 8.0, these weighings can not only be automated very accurately, but also directly from the recipe control. The connection to the Zivarex FTA system enables the dynamic adaption and composition of the recipe according to the actual quantities and combinations during weighing. Dosing can be automated in a combination of fine and rough low or, alternatively, with upward and downward dosing. This function is integrated free of charge in Braumant version 8.0 and works also with the Lean edition. My colleague Horst Fuchs is going to show you how the connection of Zivarex FTA with Braumat version 8.0 works. Thank you, Jürgen. Let's have a look at the dosing management in conjunction with the Zivarex FTA scale. You are currently faced with the task of mixing a certain sequence of components with corresponding weights or quantities. And you need to weigh this as accurately as possible for a corresponding final value. To do this, the Cimatic software and the Cimatic hardware do offer a Zivarex module. This is a corresponding module that you can connect to the normal controller via bus connection. This Zivarex module can weigh various components that can have different properties. These can be different relative values for a switching of the cores or fine shutoff valve. These can be components that are solid, viscous or completely liquid. And these are loaded into the Zivarex scale at the time of weighing. The Zivarex scale begins with a tearing, i.e. zeroing of the wagon container. It then begins to transfer this component, this material, into this weighing container. There is, for example, the attribute cores current and fine current cutoff, i.e. large and small valves are being switched off when a relative setpoint is submitted i.e. shortly before the final value of the installation is reached. Furthermore, there are tolerance values, i.e. values which allow to make this weighing correspondingly exact or inaccurate. Every time a component change occurs, these corresponding attributes are also loaded into the Zivarex scale. The highlight of the matter and in the context of Braumat is that this interface is completely integrated in the system and can therefore organize the loading of the component attributes online at the time of the component change. This also means, of course, that we now have to make the corresponding project planning for these different components in our graphic recipe system, here using malt types as an example. Each component is assigned a set of attributes, relevant for this Zivarex assembly. In the recipe system, I also define this combination of components, based on a nominal batch size. This is conveniently the amount that fits into the wagon container. So for 1000 kilos of malt mix, I now have four different malts with the corresponding relative parameters so that I get back to these 1000 kilos. The recipe procedure itself is relatively simple. It consists of only three steps. I test the scale. Is it empty? Is it teared? I dose. 
and this dosing step here multiplies itself according to the number of components and the actual amount to be weighed. It is then always inserted between emptying steps. If, for example, the weighing hopper is now full or a component change is necessary or the weighing has to be stopped, then we have installed a weighing emptying step here. We take a look at the whole example. I have five different silos here. So I could weigh five different kinds of mold. Here I have my cores and fine shutoff valves. My hopper is teared and empty. I now create a new batch into the order system at the appropriate recipe category. And I do not want to weigh 1000 kilograms normally, but let's just say I need 5000 kilos for my batch. Now some process in the background has to upscale these 5000 kilos and distribute quantities to the corresponding relative components. We can also use the online recipe view for this again. You can see how the control recipe has already been dynamically adapted to my malt quantity. I have a lot of dosing steps with the corresponding components. From the components list or combined list. I start with about 1000 kg of Munich malt. Then one emptying is necessary. Then I have 500 kg left. Within this weighing step I can make a component change. At this point, the Braumat system has to load the corresponding 9 attributes of the new material into the Sivarek scale. A new tearing is being performed and these cores and fine shutoff values are being adjusted accordingly. We now activate this recipe and see what exactly happens. We also look at the online recipe. The first dosing step is now active with the component Munich Malt 1000 kg. The decided values. I have here also my actual value, which runs upwards. Now 10 kg before the target value of 1000 kg is reached, this valve switches off. The weighing will then of course be correspondingly slower. Now I switch off the fine flow valve. Maybe I still have some material in the pipeline. This is in principle the amount that trickles down. And then I can go to the emptying of the scale. To this emptying step. Therefore, no Zivarex functionality is required. In principle, this is a step that only needs to be automated with regard to these individual emptying control elements. Then silo 1 is activated again. This time only for 500 kilograms. And now let's look at the component change. When reaching the 500 kilograms, Braumat switches to the next dosing step. Activates again the cores and fine flow valve and doses up to the expected 1000 kg. We repeat these processes until we have realized 5000 kg malt mixture, which ends up here in the mash container. To make this a little bit more transparent, we will have a look at the whole thing again as a trend graphic. 
These are the trends for the four selected silos. With the emptying curves. Here, the malt quantity inside the mesh container is shown. And now let's just look at the weighing value. Here you can see it quite clearly. We dose into the weighing hopper up to this small corner. Here the coarse flow valve is deactivated. Here the fine flow valve is deactivated. Then the same thing comes again, 500 kg and another 500 kg. And accordingly, the whole thing continues until I have just finished weighing. There is also a faceplate. The faceplate was inspired by the actual weighing faceplate of Zivarex. I can use this for analysis purposes with the corresponding attributes. A further advantage of the whole thing is, if these parameters, which have to be entered here, determined empirically at the beginning, if these parameters are not 100% correct. Because it is, let's just say December, and the outside temperatures shorten the pipelines accordingly, a correction factor of these shutoff values will be given by the Zivarek scale for this weighing over the tolerance values. And if I want to, I can transfer these values back to the Braumat data management system. So that after a few weighings, I may become even more optimal in the weighing result after correcting these parameters. We use this in the brewery for example, for malt extraction or malt mixture preparation, perhaps for hop addition or for Kieselgur mixtures. Siemens. Ingenuity for life.